Summit makes it 27 in a row and punches its ticket to the 6A state finals. And it was all Summit from start to finish against Mountainside. Second seed Storm beat the number 11 seed Mavericks 73-61. Summit now has a chance to become the second only Central Oregon boys basketball team to win a state championship. The Storm will play the number one seed Tualatin Timberwolves tomorrow afternoon at 3.30 at the Child Center in Portland. Summit senior Caden Harris explains how the team's keeping its momentum. Right now I'm just trying to keep the team together the whole time. I mean, hey, the only way we're going to win at all is if we're all doing it together. So, I mean, I'm just making sure the guys are like, keeping their head up. I mean, every time they go on a little run, I mean, just stick together every time. So, yeah. Congratulations to the Storm. Sadly, Redmond lost today to the Silverton Foxes 50-36. to The uh, Foxes now move on in uh, that bracket. Ridgeview takes on the ninth seeded Crescent Valley Raiders tonight at 6.30 at Gill Coliseum. Madras plays in the semifinals tonight at 8.15 against their Tri-Valley League rivals, the Corbett Cardinals. The White Buffaloes beat Corbett twice already in league play this year. And earlier today, Crook County, who lost yesterday, got a win in the consolation bracket against Silverton. The Cowgirls beat the Foxes in overtime, 47-44. The Cowgirls now play Willamette for fourth place in the state tomorrow morning.